Hey guys, in this video I'll show you the best price action indicator that have happened over the last few weeks. And I will show you exactly what to look for in a market and how to find those exact signal. Because those trades and those signals happen over and over again. And whether you trade Forex, whether you trade Bitcoin, indices, stocks or commodities, those are very, very important signals. And you'll be able to find those trades and those signals over and over again. So let's get into the charts. First of all, click the Indicators tab. Then simply search Price Action Reversion Bands and select this one Create by Sigma Street and add to chart. First, we will modify the settings to filter such fake signals. For Modify Setting, click on Setting tab. First go to Input tab and first here Length of Channel Change 50 to 55. After we have changed with Threshold for Pin Bar 0.3 to 3.5. After that all is everything is keep the same, so we will click on OK. Now know how to use this indicator. This indicator simply give bull and bear signal and this is above and below line called upper and lower polylines. When price action reversion bands indicator give bull signal and market price below the upper polyline, hence we will take only by entry. And similarly look further. When price action reversion bands indicator give bear signal and market price above the lower poly line, hence we will take only sell entry. We will add another indicator so that we can make this strategy more powerful. Go to the indicators tab, type Fourier smooth volume zone oscillator, select this one create by Aldo Alpha, it add to chart. You can see here Fourier smooth volume zone oscillator looking this type. First of all, we will modify the indicator like this to easy understand. For modify setting, click on setting tab. First go to input tab and here Fourier period change 3 to 35. After we have changed kernel smoothing 10 to 15 and after now go to style tab and here some options hide. Now everything is right so we will click on OK. Now we will see how we will recognize the trade from this indicator. Before identify this indicator here you can see that it is called overbought and oversold level and this red and green called VZO fill. Now we know how take entry with this indicator. We can see here first this indicator give red circle and VZO fill also red for sell trade and similar this indicator give this is green circle and VZO fill also green for buy trade. Now how to take trade with both the indicators and that is when the thing is going to get cleared. First of all for sell trade. See the price action reversion bands indicator give bear signal and market price above the lower poly line. And if we look at the second indicator give red circle and VZO fill also red. And last crossover below inside the overbought zone. And now for the final confirmation there should be a bearish candle here. Hence here the sell trade is valid. Conversely by trade, first of all, See the price action reversion bands indicator give bull signal and market price below the upper poly line. And if we look at the second indicator give green circle and VZO fill also green. And last crossover above inside the oversold zone. And now for the final confirmation there should be a bullish candle here. Hence here this buy trade is valid. I hope you must have understood this example of strategy. If not, then it doesn't matter, we are going to see examples of some test trades, so that you will definitely understand. Now we will see buy trade on Amazon chart and 5 minute time frame. First of all, see the price action reversion bands indicator give bull signal and market price below the upper poly line. And if we look at the second indicator give green circle and VZO fill also green, and last crossover above inside the oversold zone. And now for the final confirmation there should be a bullish candle here. So all our conditions are being fulfilled. So we are placing an order to buy. And stop losses will be placed below the lower poly line. And target is 1 is to 1.5 risk to reward ratio. Let's see how to play out this trade. This trade running in profit. This trade is easily hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading setup. Now let's take another by example here. First of all, see the price action reversion bands indicator give bull signal and market price below the upper poly line. And if we look at the second indicator give green circle and VZO fill also green. 
and last crossover above inside the oversold zone. And now for the final confirmation there should be a bullish candle here. So all our conditions are being fulfilled, so we are placing an order to buy. And stop losses will be placed below the lower poly line. And target is 1 is to 1.5 risk to reward ratio. Let's see how to play out this trade. We can see here this trade completely hit the target. I hope you must have liked this trading strategy. And of course, it's going to be the opposite for a sell trade. First of all, see the price action reversion bands indicator give bear signal and market price above the lower poly line. And if we look at the second indicator give red circle and VZO fill also red. And last crossover below inside the overbought zone. And now for the final confirmation there should be a bearish candle here. You can see here that all the conditions have been matched. So here we will take sell trade. And stop losses will be placed above the upper poly line. And target is 1 is to 1.5 risk to reward ratio. Let's see how to play out this trade. We can see here this trade completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy. Now let's take another sell example here. First of all, see the price action reversion bands indicator give bear signal and market price above the lower poly line. And if we look at the second indicator give red circle and VZO fill also red. And last crossover below inside the overbought zone. And now for the final confirmation there should be a bearish candle here. You can see here that all the conditions have been matched. So here we will take sell trade. And stop losses will be placed above the upper poly line. And target is 1 is to 1.5 risk to reward ratio. Let's see how to play out this trade. Here the market has not hit both the stop loss and the target. We can see here this trade completely hit the target. I hope this video has shown how the indicator works and how you can use it to enter profitable and powerful positions. And one very important thing when you use this indicator on 5 minutes or 15 minute time frame, then your stop loss will be very small. So it may be that the broker you use, they provide you very high spread, due to which your chances of hitting the stop loss will be high. So I would request you to use Exynos Broker which will provide you zero spread account, and you will be able to execute pinpoint trades in the market. Link in the description join now. If you useful this video, please hit a like and subscribe to the channel for more new strategy. Take care goodbye. Thanks for watching our video.